Hey Guardians, welcome back to your channel, where we dive deep into everything related to Bungie and Destiny 2. Today, I have something truly mind-blowing to share with you. Bungie, the brilliant minds behind Destiny, seems to have dropped another captivating Easter egg in their latest game, Marathon, which may be related to Destiny. So, if you're ready to embark on an adventure filled with intrigue and discovery, let's jump right into it. If you haven't already watched the Marathon trailer, I highly recommend giving it a watch, trust me. As you feast your eyes on the epic trailer, pay close attention to this specific moment. There it is, a peculiar worm crawls across the screen. But wait, what's that on its body? Yes, you spotted it too, a QR code. Zooming in on the QR code reveals something incredible, a link to a real website. Don't worry, I've done the hard work for you. The website is called Sekiguchi Genetics JP. Let's take a look. Now, before we dive deeper, I wanna let you know that the website is predominantly in Japanese. But don't worry, we've got Google Translate on our side. This page is visible only using a computer browser. While using your phone browser, it shows you another thing I couldn't understand. So, I recommend opening the URL on a computer for a better experience. Wow, look at all these intriguing pictures. Each one comes with an explanation, and Google Translate managed to give us some fascinating insights. However, there's a panel here that requires a password for access. It's a mystery waiting to be unraveled. Do you have any guesses on what the right password could be? Share your thoughts in the comments. Now, here's where it gets even more interesting. There might be a connection between this new Marathon Easter egg and the beloved Destiny franchise. Could the right password be hidden within the world of Destiny itself? Or could it be hidden in this website or trailer itself? The possibilities are endless. Now I would like to draw your attention to another interesting discovery. There is a real person named Sekiguchi who is a professor specializing in human genetics at the University of Michigan. She is currently working on the same subject matter. Is this merely a coincidence or is there an intentional connection here? It appears that perhaps in the future, her descendants may establish the Sekiguchi Company, or the company's founders might name it after her remarkable scientific discoveries, similar to how Elon Musk established the Tesla Company. Take a moment to listen to a segment of this website. History. Since its founding by Hideo Murakami in 2152, Sekiguchi Electronics has continued to lead the industry. With superconductivity and quantum computer systems as our core businesses, we have also actively entered related fields to promote diversification. In 2157, it also entered the automobile and robot industries and achieved great success. In 2158, Sekiguchi Electronics manufactured the first artificial brain implant module. In 2192, it manufactured various prosthetics and assistive devices, and in 2459, it began manufacturing full-body prostheses that fused the industry's highest standard artificial tissues and high-tech parts. Since the Sekiguchi Group developed the artificial brain implant module for the first time, we have created a succession of first-ever and groundbreaking technologies in every business field in the solar system. From maintenance robots to autonomous vehicles to the latest high-performance biomata, the Sekiguchi Group continues to be at the forefront of technological ingenuity and product innovation for this solar system. It's fascinating how this reminds me of the Bray family from Destiny, who worked on AI and Exos during the collapse. Clovis Bray established Bray facilities, and they used their family name for it. Again, could this similarity be intentional, or is it a coincidence? What are your thoughts on this new Easter egg or puzzle? Do you think there's a deeper connection between Destiny and Marathon? And what about the password and its meaning? I can't wait to hear your ideas and theories in the comments. That's all for today's video, folks. Thank you so much for joining me on this exciting journey of discovery. Remember to like this video if you enjoyed it, subscribe to our channel for more thrilling gaming content, and hit that notification bell so you never miss an update. Until next time, keep exploring, keep gaming, and keep unraveling those mysteries. Love you! Don't forget to drop a comment, like, and subscribe. Thank you!